Okay, welcome back to another video and today we're going to continue our discussion with the uh, production and we are going to be producing ammo, drones, weapons, modules, rigs. So first thing we're going to start with our ammunition and like a standard pause that your ammunition will be done within your ammunition assembly array. And first things first is we're always going to make sure we have the skills and as you can see you just require industry level one and all ammunition just requires your minerals to produce them so we are open up your industry and then we're gonna select production of one and I have 50 runs for this one and you can see it takes 10 hours advanced industry level 5 and industry level 5 and $45,000 with the system cost of 0 .06 so. and as you can see I'm all lit up ready to go and let's fire it off and there's the ammo so next we are gonna go into our drone assembly array and same as POST drones are done within the drone and this one's a little bit different so to produce one I'm gonna fire that up say we want to do let's do an even 10 here so as you can see 10 of the heavy fighters are going to be uh, 12 hours and it has a system of cost of 43 So when it comes to your drones, so you are going to need your industry level 1 again, as well as your capital ship construction level 1. So as you can see you need industry level 5, your advanced industry level 5, as well as your mechanics at level 5 to get your capital ship construction. So once you have that, we can do ourselves some runs. So I'm going to get one going just so that you see it goes through. And away it goes. So now coming up to the next part is uh, I'm actually going to. Okay, I do. So before we carry on any further, we are going to go to our design laboratory. And we do need to produce tech 2. So as you can see, uh, you do have to make ourselves a copy. So you go underneath copy. And a single copy at a single run is 45 minutes. And you can just fire that off any time. And then you will produce uh, blueprint copy at which time you can do your invention on it and as you can see requires your graviton physics and your electronic engineering both three of the data cores and then of course your optional decryptor I have the max in so that way I would not have any failures for the purpose of this video. So as you can see one will take me four hours and fifteen minutes and might as well fire one off. So once that has completed and you know that uh, it succeeded we're going to go back to our drone and it will produce you a tech 2 Now this is the part that is the only thing at the moment I would say that is uh, requires a component assembly array and that's just for these advanced components here. And you remember you do require some tech 1 before you can uh, produce your tech 2. And using the top of the line that's down actually just just do a single run 
So a single run is uh, an hour and 13 minutes at $12,000. And as you can see, as you get to the advanced science, it does uh, help with, uh, with your time. So once again, we're going to fire this off and watch it go. And it's being produced. So it's the exact same steps when it comes to your Templars. Once again, just takes minerals. Single run is at an hour, and it's at a thousand S. Tech two. Once again, you got P one PI. You got some advanced components here, as well as your Tech one. And you're looking at again an hour and 13 minutes. So that covers the drones. Now, when it comes to everything else, everything else is done within your equipment. As you can see, I have my rigs, I have my modules even got the services and as you can see some of these are going to be requiring uh, actual salvage and let's open her up okay so first Let's do the weapons first. So when it actually comes to weapons here, it does need your outpost construction at level one, and I'll actually open up the info. That way you can pull out the, uh, so you can see it takes industry level five, anchoring level five, and mechanics level five, just as a reminder to get up to outpost construction which is the exact same as you need for producing citadels. So as you can see it just takes minerals once again. A single run is at 5 hours at 15,000 esk. And it just requires your industry skills to, in to increase the time, well decrease the time I should say. So I'm running out of production slots so I actually won't hit start but you can see it's all lit up ready to go. Next um, let's do a module here. And once again these only do require that you have outpost construction level 1 once again. And it just requires minerals. Single run up 5 hours. And now let's do a quick one of the service module. So as you can see this one does require your PI as well as minerals. Single run at 5 hours. Whoops. And as you see, once again, it's outpost construction level one. So here's where things are going to change up a little bit. And let's do ourselves a reprocessing rig. So we do have our tech one or level one of the. Uh, reprocessing rigs and these require your just your standard salvage so we're going to open up the skill the info here and you can see it just requires industry level one so pretty much anybody can start producing these almost immediately once you get to get your industry
Okay, so here we are. We are in s at the uh, processor 2. And as you can see, it takes more of the advanced salvage. And it has 6 hours. And a job cost of 1 million esque. Lovely. And we got a couple different other uh, more of the advanced in uh, not industry but science skills. So now we're gonna move on to a standard medium rig, and it's 25 minutes. Take salvage, and all level one rigs require that you have your just your industry level one. I think the only exception might be your doomsday. We'll have a look at that because there are some changes. So th once again with your level 2 of your standard combat rigs, it's going to be the more advanced salvage and you're going to need the more advanced uh, science skills as well. So for instance this one has the quantum physics and high energy physics. So, moving down, we are going to be taking a quick look at the Doomsday. So, Doomsday level 1, I be believe that's still industry level, it's industry level 5, yeah. And here... You do need your industry level 5 once again, as well as your more advanced science skills. And I actually wanted to pull one up. There are four major science skills that will allow you to produce most of uh, these more advanced rigs. And here we are. So basically the main four are your science level 5, your mechanics at level 5, and power grid at level 5, and it's only 3. So moving up into the uh, more of the extra large GAN, as you see I brought all the uh, salvage here with me. So now I'm just going to hit start so you can watch one of these go through. And did I bring it up with me to do doomsday? No. There we go, we'll fire off one of those. There goes the weapons. So as you can see, everything went through, everything will be ready within a couple hours to a day. So that basically covers the construction of all the uh, components and modules and that. So I hope this helped answer any questions you may have had, and you have a good one, and we'll see you next time. Okay, bye.